Y'all just use GPA, DP, GP, P, 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 in, in the house, house. Anyway, across the street, you see those big old dogs hanging out the lift ledge over there? I'm still recovering from that um, sauce and stuff that, uh, <laughs> whatever oh, stuff is not nice, messing with my eyes and stuff. But it's all cool, three big old dogs and stuff on that ledge. I just imagine dogs were that big, boy. Yeah. Like super bears. Man. Anyway, this is Nagoya. About to head out back to uh, Osaka. Hit on that freeway and roll out. Woo! Back to the basics. Back to basics. There was a lot of foreigners up here yesterday, though. Back to basics, cannot fix this. It's a lot of Filipinos, There's Brazilians, a lot, of, a lot of people up here, not Chinese, going. Mexicans, Peruvians, Indians, Colombia. <laughs> we got them all, man. Americans, all sorts of Look at the dogs. That's terrible. <laughs> Cujo in the middle. Oh, that's the soft bank dog too. The white Shiba. Yay. I love dogs. This is uh the the uh Nagoya station over here. Yeah, this so this, this the broke side. Where is it at? This the poor side, it's the broke side. Oh yeah, check out the streets. people man. I gotta find out which side of the station I'm on. I thought I was on the front, I bet you I'm on the back. Yes, yeah, we're on the back side. This is the soccer site. This is, actually this is the front of the station I believe. This is front of, this is the front Nagoya station. This is the Tycho side. And that's the uh Maria Towers, Hotel Shopping Malls, another Lexus right there. I can't got to do this right turn somewhere over here. Oh, no, no, I can go to the left. Roll out. You hear that squeak? That's my car. got to get some brake cleaning. Uh oh, oh that, that's not too My bad. brakes are, like, all dirty. My whole car is dirty. That's a mess. Okay, <coughs> let's see. Go out here far enough. They gotta go down. Oh, I could have went the other way. Oh man, I'm like really tripping on going out the way now. Okay, I'm out. Anyway, these are the stories along the bottom on the mall. My friend, he works at number one friend. He's out here, but probably working. Not working, probably off. So it's all cool. He's a Japanese guy. He ended up marrying a white girl. That was his dream. <laughs> he accomplished it. Alright. Mission accomplished. I came to stop this microphone. I need to suck his unconscious. Yeah. Now he feel he got an S on his chest. Oh, got no. a girl that got big. I don't know if it was all about that. It was just... Well, he was dating this one fine Japanese girl, man, but she was messing around with, this, with the uh, baseball players and stuff. Yikes. And, uh, but she was hanging out with him, too. She was... I was going to say, when I first came to Japan, you know, I was uh, pretty much hanging around all the fine Japanese girls and stuff. Mm -hmm. So people talk stuff like, they're not ugly, they're not pretty. So I'm like, huh? Because the ones that weren't fine, I wasn't really, you know, around any of them, really. Mm -hmm. It was like all, you know, like the picture I showed you, right? Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. Her the and the first. Uh, yeah, and then, it, and then it's the ones that look like her and then the ones that got the, the um, thin almond. Mm-hmm. Faces and it's a trap. Uh, oh, look at this door. So this Uma Kazuma. Mm. What kind of store is there? Looks like a nighttime. Nantoka Yaki. Yeah. Yakitori. Yakitori. But it's, it's cool because you come out here, you know, mm. and your brothers out there that can cook, I mean, you come out here yeah, and man. open up one of these little shops and whip up some soul food, man. You would make so much money coming out here cooking soul food. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't know. 
I mean, you don't. If you don't, they will. Yeah. Okay. Only thing it gets take is like one or two of them to steal your idea. Uh, that's Next it. Thing you know, come back over here. They be going cooking up collard greens. Collard greens and everything. And shit might cook it better than you, and you be like, <laughs> "How this happen? For real, man? Cause you ain't doing it. Somebody gonna do it, dude. Man, like yeah, that African know. shop we went to. What were they selling? Hip hop. What's hip hop? Oh, but like you know what? Yeah, they were selling the. Yeah, man. What man. were they selling? American culture to a certain exactly. degree. Exactly, American black culture. That's a certain degree, nothing. That's all they were selling. It was all they had all those foreign people, like a lot of Brazilians was yeah, up in there, true. Indonesians, yeah. Filipinos, you know. And that's what I'm saying, you know. A lot of people talk about how much they hate us, you know. We're in America because we're all distracted. But when, when you know, you go to a place like Japan where the majority of people don't even pay you no attention and stuff, you know. Yeah. You tend to, everybody tend to swarm together and they look at you and smile like the two bro, the two guys walked by us and said, "What's up, brother?" Uh, oh, yeah, I don't yeah. know if you heard it, but I heard well, it. What? What? They, when we first got there? Yeah. And yeah, that old sort of stuff. Remember. He's like, "Where you, know? you from?" And it was a trip though. And then the dude that owned that store that we went to was one of my homies from a long time ago. See, right, yeah. that's what I mean too, man. Yeah. He was like, well, what happened to you? You look different. I said, yeah, I got fat. He said, yeah, you did. Ha, 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 ha. It's okay, I'm going to get to get rid of this stuff. A 10-second workout. Yeah, I'll be doing it. But it works, though. Yeah, how about Uno's? How was Uno's? Oh, Uno's. you said the the the. Yeah, I was like, it was just too watery, man. Uh -huh. They had another one over by uh, Sudamai. Uh -huh. And I go to Sudamai. It was real good. That was real famous. It was always crowded to be a bunch of honeys up in there and stuff. Yeah, we got off the elevator, Teddy, and this one girl came off the elevator and she looked at someone, somebody, and smiled like four times. I was like, wow. She was. That's what I like about Nagoya. People out here are really, really friendly. It's like. It's like. I ain't gonna tell you what it's like. But it's like something off of those guys.